Okay, sixth graders, here's what I want you to do. I gave you this yesterday. It says, choose two phrases to form a sentence that correctly uses a word from the word list one. And everybody has this word list. I gave this to you the other day. Okay, and it's two sides. It's got 15 words. And so I'm looking at the very first one here. And it's got four choices for you. Let that person go free to clasp someone is to treat that person badly to persecute someone is to. And so you're going to put two of them together. And we already did this one yesterday. It's C and D. And so the two that you choose, then you create a sentence out of it. To persecute someone is to treat that person badly. Those are the two that we put together. And you highlight the vocabulary word that it's that it uses so then we did number two together let's look at number two number two has again there's four phrases and you'll notice that two of the four phrases are always always capitalized so you know it's going to be one of those two is going to be the first part of the sentence so these are the two that we picked if something has appeal it has the power to attract those are the two, when put together, forms a sentence. And so what did I do? I wrote that down. If something has appeal, it has the power to attract. And the vocabulary word I just highlighted. All right. And then there's the third one. I'll do one more. Number three, notice I'm drawing, or not drawing, but I'm putting a blank line between each one. So let's look at number three together here. Here are the four phrases. To exhibit something is to. To unveil something is to. Understand it fully. Reveal it for the first time. So we're putting two of these four together. Now, let me point out something to you. That A and B are the ones that are capitalized. So you know it's going, the first part of the sentence that you're going to write, it's going to be one of these two because they're capitalized. So let's look at some, let's look at A here. To exhibit something is to understand it fully. No. Does that make sense? No. no, not really. To exhibit something is to reveal it for the first time. No. Yeah, that really doesn't make sense. So let's look at this one. Look at B. To unveil something is to understand it fully. Not really. I mean, it could, but it's not a good fit. To unveil something is to reveal it for the first time. So these are the two that are a good match. And you write that sentence down. Notice a blank line here. So to unveil... Reveal it for the first time. There's my alarm reminding us it's time to go to the library here in a couple of minutes. Okay, now, in here, which word is one of your vocabulary words? And so I'm just going to highlight that. You can use a highlighter or... If you just wanted to use something and underline it darkly, that's fine too. So that's how you do these. And here's the rest of them, you guys. I'm going to zoom this out. There's four, five, six, seven, eight, and there's nine. Okay, so I'll slide it back to four. And if you don't finish it today, you can watch this video tonight and grab the last. You can just pause the video when I got up to those last ones there. All right, I'm going to stop this.